Praise the Lord, beautiful people of God. This morning devotion is entitled Overcoming Sadness by Kill Harms. You turn my willing into dancing. You remove my sackcloth and clothe me with joy. Psalms 30, verse 11. Every once in a while I'm overwhelmed by fears that my cancer will return. The fear often catches me off guard and leads me to despair. I don't relish the sad days, but I know it's okay to have them. On the hard days, however, I know that God still loves me. As I endure the melancholy and tears, I know the pain will eventually pass. Recently, on the evening of a sad day, a group of my son's friends came for dinner. They came every week and filled my house with laughter while they ate my mediocre cooking. My sadness almost caused me to cancel the gathering, but something happened as they all happily crammed around our dinner table. My sadness lifted and was replaced with joy. Those boys will likely never know it, but God used their happiness to bring me peace. Much in life can bring deep sadness, but God is good and a giver of good things. Life itself is a gift. My sons are a gift, and their friends are gifts. My time on this earth is a gift, and every sad second and joy-filled moment. Our thought for today, sadness will come, but God's gift of joy will follow. Let us pray. Dear God, thank you that you're always with us, even in our deep sadness. Thank you for the beautiful ways that you show up to bring us joy. Amen. Once again, I'm going to encourage you to subscribe to this channel and please pass this devotion to five new people and encourage them to subscribe as well. God bless you and you have a great day.